it is me and a very happy March to everybody and it is time I am on time for once with my sips by Mar sips by March no sips by box March 2023 and I am super excited to get into it so without any more further ado with trusty pocket life let us get into it shall we now the usual spiel if you're unfamiliar with Sips by Box, it is a really awesome monthly subscription box. And every month you get four new teas made just for you. Yes, you take a quiz and if you don't like caffeine, caffeinated teas, if you don't like minty teas, if you prefer loose over bag, it is personalized 100% just for you. And happily, we have our normal cards back. So it says, made with love uniquely for you. And it says, hi, springtime is just around the corner, promising warmer weather and the first blooms of the season. While we wait for its arrival, we hope you enjoy cozying up and sipping the teas we've chosen for you this month. XO, cheers, team, sips by, and I am super excited to get into this because this is a really heavy box. They've made the boxes smaller, but the amount of tea inside is still the same. And first thing I see right on top is, of course, our reusable drawstring baggie. And then on the inside, we have our little disposable bags here. And if you're interested in picking up your first Sips by Box, I have a link down below for $15 off your box. So why not try out some new teas because even if you don't have a tea infuser, they provide one just for you. So first thing I see, oh, this must be why it is so dang heavy. Wow. So we have four bags of tea right here, and they are thick. And so here is the back of our tea bag. And it says it is cranberry spice. Ooh. So let's see. Cranberry spice from Jada Chi. I think that's how that said. It is a caffeine-free tea, and it says, Enjoy the bold flavors of cranberry and ginger wrapped in fall spices. This herbal tea is blended to perfection to help keep you warm during the fall and winter seasons. Which is kind of funny when it just said, It's time to get ready for spring, and I have a fall tea. I guess it was fall tea thinking. Sorry, pun. I had to do it. But I'm going to definitely like it because I love fall spices all year and it says it is hibiscus cranberries ginger orange peel cinnamon clove allspice and nutmeg so that sounds really nice and it's a caffeine free tea which means i can have it anytime i want next is and i believe these were yeah these are um loose leaf inside of here but these are four bags of bagged tea and it says choice organics and it looks like we have a Reboost tea, which is very, very nice. So Choice Organic Reboost. So is Organic Reboost tea, which is naturally caffeine-free. Smooth and mellow, the Reboost herbal tea is flush with deep amber co color. Savor subtle notes of creamy vanilla as you sweet sip the sweet and earthy tea. That is very true. Reboost has a very good... Um, Mouthfeel is, I guess, the word for it, where it feels full and rich in your mouth and without adding anything to it. And it is a fantastic flavor. I love it so much. So that one will be greatly appreciated. Up next, we have four more bags. Wow, there's a lot of bag teas this go around. And I, the packaging is so pretty. We have an elephant here on the front. And then in the back, we can actually see our teas right there. So this is um, dandelion and elderflower. Ooh. So let's see. This says it's from Trank Bar, which can, it contains caffeine. This aromatic black tea is infused with the elderflower, dandelion root, strawberry, and rose hip seed. This is the perfect tea to remind you of a Nordic summer day. Ooh. That sounds really cool. And again, now we have we have fall and winter and we have summer, so I feel like we need a spring tea. So, ooh, nice! They've been doing this a lot more, at least with my boxes lately. I got a matcha, and I am super excited for that because I love a good matcha tea. So this is cardamom matcha, aromatic, warm, and distinct. So I guess it's more 
my personal tea tastes tend to lean towards spicy teas, so that would explain why it's a spring box, but there's still some spice in here. So let's see. We have uh, from Three Leaf Tea. It is a medium caffeine tea with Japanese matcha and natural flavor. Rich aromatic cardamom matcha awakens your senses with each sip. Cardamom is often described as having a piney but crisp fruity flavor with a complex aroma. That is kind of true. I cannot wait to try this. I think it's March, the month of St. Patrick's Day. So um, let's definitely brew up some bright green tea. So one moment, teas. Alrighty then, here we have our very lovely green matcha tea. And so this is the three leaf cardamom matcha, so let us take a sippy sip. Ooh, that is very, very cardamomy and spicy. So first off, this is not normally how I take my matcha. I usually sweeten it and add milk, so I'm going to take another couple sips and see what I think. Yes. Okay, so this is a unsweetened matcha, so it is very earthy and very strong, so I'm going to be adding, it is a mixture of whole milk, cream, and sugar, which is normally what I put in my matcha tea. Oop, there we have the color changing. Awesome. And oop, watch as I spill it absolutely everywhere, including on myself. So I have my little matcha whisk and this is an electric one from david's tea which i absolutely love and so i'm just gonna zhuzh it up and try not to get a great big green mess everywhere all right so here's how i would normally take it with milk cream and sugar mm, much better um the milk at least for me, tends to cut away some of the really strongness that some and bitterness that some matchas have, and especially if they are a true unsweetened matcha. So if you have doubts, if you get this tea, add some sugar, try it out, then add some cream or milk and see if you like that better. Because for me, it's usually a um, matcha kind of latte y thing. So. Mm. Definitely a little bit sweeter and a little bit smoother with the milk added and it goes from For me like a six to a nine. So it bumps up the flavor So that makes it really really nice mm. Absolutely perfectly perfectly The way I like it now Alrighty so that was everything in the box for this month. I really enjoyed the matcha once I made it my way. And also I thought I would give you some updates for the month of March. As you can see, my nails have no holo taco on them currently. And that is because shipping to me right now is the One Coat Chrome collection. So keep your eyes out for that. And there will also be the um, Owl Crate unboxing two of those this month and there's also a Lush Kitchen subscription that is on its way currently and also the Lit Joy Magical box is on its way so lots of things happening this month so make sure you have that bell ringing so that you can never miss my videos because there are some really good ones coming out this month and also um, I don't know if I've mentioned it recently, but I've also turned on super chats and super thanks down in the comments section. So if you want to help support my channel with any little bit of amount, it would be greatly appreciated so that I can keep you informed on tea and fun magical products and of course books. So everybody, thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in checking out another video, go ahead and click right here. And if you're new, welcome to my channel and go ahead and click that subscribe button so that you never miss my videos ever again. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!